But right now I'm going to tell you about this clip we got coming up. Reverend Bud Rose, he has a program, a TV program named Country Gospel Time, and he resides in Sycamore, Ohio. He's consented to airing some of our shows back there around Cleveland, Toledo, area, and all through them parts, and we thank God for that opportunity and the door for being open. He sent us some DVDs of his Country Gospel Time program and said he, we could use some clips off of this for our program, which we're going to do today. I think. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. We are R&T Puppets. This is my husband, Ron. That's me. And I'm Terry. That's her. And this is Annette. Hi there. And we're going to do a skit called Troubles to Joy. Yep. All right. You ready? Yep. Okay, go for it. Hi, Terry. Well, hi there, Annette. How's everything going? Oh, everything's just fine and dandy. Well, that's good. No, that's bad. Why is that bad? It's boring. Everything is going too good. When there's no excitement, it gets boring. Yeah, I sort of know what you mean. That is too bad. No, that's good. <laughs> well, why is that good? Because it gives me time to think. I don't have much time to just sit and think. Well, that's good then. No, that's bad. Uh, why is that bad? Well, I usually sit here and start thinking about all my problems. Who wants to spend all their time thinking about trouble? Oh, you're right in that. That is bad. No, that's good. What do you mean? Why is that good? Well, because if I never thought about trouble, then I'd never know how to solve my problem. Yeah, that is good. No, Terry, that's bad. Uh, why is that bad? Because I can never figure out how to solve my problems anyway. So then I just sit here, and that gets boring. Well, you know, it wouldn't be so bad if you'd let Jesus help you figure out how to solve your problems. Well, I suppose that's good. No, Annette, that's great. No, Terry, that's bad. Why is it bad? Because Jesus isn't around to help me. No, that's good. Even though Jesus isn't here physically, we have his word, the Bible, to help us with our problems. Well, I suppose that is good. Sure it is. Just look at James 1, 2. This verse tells us that even though our troubles aren't always pleasant, we should consider them all joy. That's bad. Why is it bad? Because some of my problems are awful. How can I count them a joy? Ah, oh, Annette, don't be so pessimistic. That can be good. You just need to read God's word and pray that he will help you with your problems. When God helps you solve your problems, you will see that it wasn't so bad after all. Yeah, I guess you're right, Terry. Hey, why don't we sing a song? Oh, I think that's a wonderful idea. What yeah. song would you like oh, to sing? Oh, let's see. Uh, oh, in the sweet die and die. All right, let's go for it. Okay. You get to start. Okay. Okay. 